keeping it too. Absolutely, and especially over the last couple of days, we've seen those really cold temperatures across the region. But recently, just last night into this morning, we've seen a brand new air mass make its way into the region, bringing us some cloud cover and some significantly warmer overnight temperatures. Still a little bit chilly in those afternoons. So what we saw just yesterday, especially around that sunset time frame, beautiful conditions out there, a little bit of cloud cover here and there. Still some blue skies from yesterday. This morning, we're going to be seeing a whole lot more cloud cover as we're a little bit closer to the storm that brought us these clouds, but this wonderful photo photo sent in by Carrie Applegate using the hashtag be on KSBY. If you, if you have any photos like this one that you're particularly proud of, we would love to see them. Be sure to send them to us using that hashtag. We'd love to feature them right here on KSBY News Daybreak. Now looking at those clouds, we did see significant cloud cover overnight. Still some more clouds moving through the region for today. We will be seeing the possibility of some more sunshine later on today as the system moves a little bit farther towards the west. The main portion of the system that is bringing us all this cloud cover is it's actually well up into the Bay Area, so we're not going to be seeing too much of that right now. Just the slightly warmer temperatures. Checking out those temperatures right now, 45 degrees in Santa Maria, 41 in California Valley and San Ynez, 47 in Santa Barbara, and 49 degrees in Cambria right now. That is a lot warmer than it was just yesterday. 10 degrees warmer in Cambria, San Luis Obispo, and Santa Maria, 8 degrees warmer in the Cuyama Valley, and 7 degrees warmer in Santa Barbara. Alongside that system that's bringing some rain, that's where that warmer air is moving into the region as well. So warmer conditions for today, but still rain is falling throughout much of the Bay Area, pushing its way towards us. But but unfortunately, this high pressure sitting down to the south of us is really blocking any of that energy from making its way towards us here on the central coast. We do have the slightest chance for a little bit of this rain to just clip the very most northern portions of the central coast, but even that will be very minimal. And if you want more rain, though, you don't have to wait too long. We will be seeing rain later on this weekend moving in by about the midday hours on Saturday with a few scattered shower potentials. The main impact is actually going to be in the evening hours when the vast majority of the central coast will be seeing at least some rain Saturday night into Sunday morning. Then some scattered light showers are possible all the way through the daytime hours on Sunday. This system could be bringing us up to about a half an inch of rain. I think it's more likely, though, that we'll see up to about a third of an inch of rain in some portions of the central coast, a little bit less in those interiors and along our south coast. But that's not here just yet for today. Temperatures around 60 degrees in Paso Robles, 62 in San Luis Obispo, 61 in Santa Maria, 63 in Lompoc, and 66 degrees in Santa Barbara for today. And over the next seven days. We will be seeing that rain chance Saturday night into Sunday, lasting through the daytime hours on Sunday with a few scattered showers, then staying clear and warming up ever so slightly through the daytime hours throughout the rest of next week with a little bit more sunshine. Definitely different than what we're seeing for today. Neil and Janelle, back to you. All right.